this is a tough uh, intro to make, I think. And this is my third attempt, really. Um, I'm just recording over the second because I already deleted my uh, assets for what you're looking at now. Well, all of them except for the image, the new avatar image, which is something I need to go over as well. I didn't go over it in, in this. Um, the first attempt is actually its own standalone video and you can see it over, see it on this channel still, surprisingly. However, if I decide to delete it, it's still saved on, uh, um, it's still saved over web archives, um, the Facebook version of it. I upload it hit over to Facebook and archived it as soon as possible after it got struck down pretty much. Um, so the notepad document you're looking at is what I originally planned for this intro. And by the time I got to recording this, uh, that went way out the window. Um, don't get me wrong, I still believe everything written there, except for there's some information I've got wrong here on uh, the uh, Hispanics there. I just recently looked it up just to know what I'm saying, and apparently it's in America, not just South America. Though, might as well be South America, where it's a problem. Mostly a problem. Um, anyways... Um, the uh, YouTube comment I've got over in the corner there is actually something I found on a video on kind of my subject here. Um, <clears throat> that uh, comment is something I personally agree with. And, uh, and, um, As someone who doesn't believe that Black Lives Matter is actually fighting racism, I mean, they're fighting racism against blacks, sure, but they don't want to just fight for equality. They want domination. That's what I've seen from them. They want domination. They want to be at the top of the food chain. They just want to tip the scales over into their favor. They don't want the tails on an equal playing field. And I can try and explain why I think this, but it'll take for fucking ever. Um, however, I have looked into other ways of uh, fighting racism that is going on today. The uh, company that you're seeing in the upper left corner there, that company's name, they are... A, uh, well, they're basically doing the same thing as Black Lives Matter matters, except for they're actually trying to strike at the root of the problem, the legal system. Um, so, if you're going to give to a company to fight racism, I suggest giving to them instead of Black Lives Matter. Um... So, yeah, anyways, um, I need to zero in over on the, I already mentioned it, um, I need to zero in on that, uh, Latin America issue there, um, my camera keeps blinking in and out, um, I'm not sure how to actually address this. Cause it does affect me a lot. Even not my I myself am not Latino. I have family that's Latino, and I have people that mean the world to far. So, 
Um, but <sighs> there is a change for petition I found. Um, and I'll be leaving it in the video descriptions from now on until I see that it's reached its goal because at that point there's nothing you can do about it. Um, and that doesn't just mean on this channel. It means on all my channels. Um, I'm going to be leaving a link to that. Um, I want to do something about this issue and I think that's one way I can. You know? Even if it's just small things. I'm gonna fight racism where it exists, not where it doesn't. And I'm not going to perpetuate the idea that only racist either, which is what Black Lives Matter does. Because they can't, and they aren't. Racism exists there and in everyone. It is a learned behavior. And I think it's learned by those who don't know any better. I'm not sure how to say that really. Um, but yeah. So that was quite a bit here. Um, I'm actually going to be uh, breaking the video this is attached to into two parts. It's not really going to be broken into two parts, but I'm going to like have to cut it into because uh, there's a very <laughs> controversial character coming up. Uh, controversial. I didn't know this character was going to come up in uh, that episode. I didn't even really remember that character even existed in this game. I'm sure the character plays a bigger role, but still. So, this video will be ending kind of abruptly. I think this has been a safer way of doing this. Um, oh yeah, I need to address the new image. Obviously, Dare to Dream is in stars. Um, you can see that I was going for making a new hashtag. That was before I found the company in the upper left. And that was also before I found that petition. Or not, is it a petition? I'm not sure how you call that. Yeah, it is a petition. Okay. So, and honestly, I drew the image itself before I even came up with the idea of making that hashtag. I figured it fit my channel well, so. But, yeah, so. I'll probably be using that a lot more. Obviously, it's my uh, new channel art, so. Anyways, I think I've rambled on enough. Uh, onto the video. Well, that was certainly an intro. Um, fuck. Anyways. So, last time we left off, uh, I don't think this is where we saved. Pretty sure we saved at the curve. Huh. Yeah, we did. Interesting. Anyways, last time we uh, fought Eugene. And as it turns out, I was actually wrong about Eugene. Apparently, he is a prince, so I'll let you know why I know this when I get to it. And that will turn me back. I'm an idiot. Apparently, he is the prince. So, what's that? Are you alright? I'm so glad you're not hurt. This Behind you! Do you 
really expect to get out of here alive. That meth made no noise. Oh, it's you, Eugene. I will unleash the power within Linear to become the true successor of ancient civilization. You're crazy. Linear is just Linear. She's got nothing to do with ancient civilizations or evolution. You are completely ignorant. What do you know about ancient civilizations or evolution? I won't hand over evolution to anybody. You will die here and now! Okay. He'll get the first shot. Most likely. Is this the face of ultimate evolution? I that one. Okay, now that we're here, this is Prince Eugene, according to the guide. So before it was just Eugene, now it's Prince Eugene. Um, his attacks are Knockdown, Nail, which he'll be using a lot for sure, according to this guide. Uh, and try and try Waffle. That was hard to pronounce. Fire Rolling Bomb, which we just saw. Apparently that has the ability to put characters to sleep. It looks like Chain might actually be asleep when I think about it. Fifteen... Ugh. Now on 1500. He doesn't use this very often, so you won't have to worry about it too much. And he also has a cancel effect move of... Oh shoot, did I forget to move... Ah, I forgot to move Prey up. He has a cancel effect move called Patient Light. That's not going to bother us too much, I don't think. Gray is supposed to be in the center <laughs> for this fight. The only person you want in the front is uh, Mag. Everybody else you want in the center. Um, what we're going to be doing here is we're going to be using our most powerful cypher amp attacks with uh, Mag, so I'd assume Hammer again. And... Uh, with Eugene, we're actually going to want to um, boost up our attack as often as possible. We will also want to uh, use up Nalans until we can no longer use Nalans. From that point on, you'll want to use Gray as your healer. So that's the... Um, that is the strategy that you want to go with here. There are some items that you want to have, but you probably don't at this point if you followed me, so. We're just going to use Strike Hammer. This battle is pretty long. Skills. We can use V-Blade. New move for Chain. That'd be Diamond Blade? Whatever. I'm gonna move uh, Gray up one. It was a waste of a turn, but. This move, you don't have to worry about too much. Alright, next will be Air Blade for uh, Chain. Let's see, so, skills, huh, um, we should cipher and level by one in combat, next, next turn of critical hits. Oh yeah, we got that. We can use that if we really need it to fall back on. Um, struck bonus to boost their attack. That's good grip. How much more does that do than... It's less. Doesn't that one here? Boost 43. Yeah. We're just gonna use get a grip. 
Obviously, we should do it on the eye first. Your defense is on me. Strong attack for just a standard attack. Um, for Mag though, we're not gonna be wasting away like that. We're gonna actually uh, look to see if we can't do anything about his FP here. There we go, right there. Manoka Opal. Manoka Ample. Hopefully that's not my last one though, Ben. I'll give no quarter. Get a grip to chain. Your defense is on me. One twelve. Still not bad. Alright, hammer parts. Let's see. Strike hammer. Just kind of a go to there. 412. What? Sack again. 106. I'm probably just gonna attack with Chain until Mag needs more, some more uh, FP. Get it correct. It just seems like a good stopping point for uh, that weapon. Ah, come on. I just buffed Mag twice. Uh, 
Goodbye, camera. Three seventy-eight. That was not the strongest it could have been. Alright, looks like Bag will be needing uh, some more of peace. Looks like Mag will be needing some more FP here soon. Uh, it's back to Chain. After uh, Gray will go back to Mag. Mag's going to be wasting his turn uh, healing though, so next turn I'll actually be using Gray to uh, power up Chain. Who's going to be attacking right now? By the way, do not feel uh, too sparing on your uh, Malin. If you really need it. Oh, um, I guess I'm not powering anybody up right now. There you are! 80. Oh, in fact, the chain. Um. Yeah, actually, let's heal up here. Don't feel too bad about using Nalin right now. This is actually the fight that we were saving down up for. No. No. Oh, what a worthless attack. FP, 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 FP. I need FP, come on. Oh, shit. I think I'm out of milk and apples. Yep, I am. So, I'm out of uh, a few restoring items. I'm fucked. This is going to be a lot longer than it needs to be. to use moves only when he's at 50 FP. I'm not sure about Shane. And Gray has his skill here. It's actually usable now. 28. Um, we should probably save up until somebody actually can use our move, though. Otherwise, it'll just be a waste. So for now... Yeah, Gray's just gonna attack. For now. Kind of waiting for it to get back to chains so I know chains exact uh, number. I'll get no quarter. Alright, chains exact number is 36. Okay, so for mag 50, for gray it's 28, I believe? I might be wrong on that. 28, and then for chain 36. Um, for now though, straight up attack. Mag is actually probably going to get that to his number four chain does. At the rate we're going. I think Mag might be a little faster. That might be why. 101 84 179 Yikes, that's a powerful move. Does that also restore any... Yeah, he restores 3 FP because I was hoping. And Mag's good to get. Oh 
shit. I'm not sure if I want to heal or not. Probably not. Chain's at 26 now, so he's almost actually able to use his move. I'm gonna wait on actually pulling it off though. Wait, no. His move would be 36, so he's 10 away from his move. Now he's closer. 48. He only needs two more. Mag can finally use his uh, move. That's a lot of wasted bullets. Now I think about it. Um. So skills, manners, get a grip to Mag. Chain can actually use her move as well now. I'm gonna wait to use it until powered up by uh, Gray though. Four twelve. Is that it? One of four. That's it. Chinko to feed the enemy. Now I'm way better. Ancient civilizations, I will not be 
docked. Okay, get on the boat. You're coming with me. This warship will not last much longer. Come on, Linear. Can't you hear me? Didn't you hear what I said? Either way, get on the boat now, Linear. All right, now I'm getting mad. Get on the boat within the count of three, or else! One... Two... Three! he could do to me. Um, do you mind if I lean on you, Linear? Let's get away on that boat. I don't think you realize how major that is that she talks. She's been mute all the way to this point. 